minus 15. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And lift off. The girls pitching down range. Stage one chamber pressure is not open. Just about 40 seconds into flight, Falcon 9 clearing the tower at Space Launch Complex 40 and making its way to orbit. We are currently throttling down the Berlin 1D engines on the first stage in preparation for the point of max Q. That's the point of maximum aerodynamic pressure. Falcon 9 is supersonic. Maximum aerodynamic pressure is the point when the highest stresses are experienced by the vehicle during the ascent. With that, we are through the highest stresses on the vehicle. Coming up, we've got several events back to back. The first of those is main engine cutoff, or MECO. There will shut down the nine Merlin 1D engines in preparation for stage separation. Stage separation is where the pneumatic pushers will separate the first and second stages. And then we'll have second engine start number one. We just heard a call out for MVAC chillin', so we've begun chilling in the turbo pumps in preparation to start the Merlin vacuum engine on the second stage. While the second stage engine is burning, the first stage will be performing a flip maneuver, and then it will do a boost back burn. That boost back burn will ignite three of the Merlin 1D engines uh, to make the first stage's way back towards land, since we are attempting a land landing today with this first stage. So again, those events back to back, Miko, stage separation, first stage flip, second engine start number one, and then the boost back burn. Stage one shut down. Stage separation confirmed. Invac ignition. Stage one, boost back startup. So there is those five events. Awesome shots from the ground. You can see the first stage boosting away. That was on the left part of your screen and the second stage continuing to burn. Now this burn on the first stage will last about uh, 47 seconds. And the second stage is going to continue burning for a while. It won't complete its burn until T plus eight minutes and uh, 20 or so second mark. Shortly after the boost back burn ends, the next major milestone will be fairing separation. You'll see that on the right hand side of your screen. Stage one boost back shut down. So there is successful shutdown of the boost back burn. You're seeing some pulses there from the ground from our attitude control system. We use nitrogen gas as our attitude control medium and it helps us keep pointed in the correct direction. Here you can see the bursts firing on the first stage on the left hand side of your screen as we are also deploying our Bearing grid fence. separation confirmed. 